Today, I'm back on my bullshit, back on the regularly scheduled programming. I'm going to be doing an active wear haul today and everything is from Aerie, the offline collection. I have tried offline before and I was pretty impressed with it. I think it's really nice fabric and quality and there's always sales. So pro tip, don't buy anything outside of a sale. So I got everything here for reduced costs. And just for reference, I got every single thing I'm gonna be showing you guys in a small today. I have multiple active wear try on hauls on my channel so if you like this kind of stuff be on the lookout constantly posting stuff like this because i just love active wear and spending all my money on it let's get on with the video first item i'm gonna talk about i actually wore all day yesterday so safe to say i'm be keeping it it is just this it's called a sports bra i believe i got it in a small here's what it looks like it's like a long line sports bra but the kicker is there's no built-in cup pads which i was a little bit thrown off by. I wish that the, a lot of the items in this haul had cup pads, but it doesn't. So if you have bigger chests, I don't know if I'd recommend it, but I have a B-size cup and these things give me a decent bit of support. I would say this is low to medium support. There's no adjustability, but I'm going to be wearing this just like casually outside of the gym. So I actually wore this to like go shopping yesterday to get my nails done, stuff like that. So this will definitely be a more casual, just easy black tank to throw on. It is slightly brush and it's a thicker material. I think it's really cute and a great staple to have. Definitely true to size as well. The next item I'm gonna talk about are like my favorite things I got in this haul. They're these sweatpants. They are so nice. I'll put screenshots of what the product is on the screen, but these sweatpants are amazing. If you've watched my videos before, I have a love for these Loft Lou and Gray sweatpants and they're like my favorite thing ever. They're so soft. Well, these are very, I don't know, they're in a race. I don't know which is my favorite. These give me Lou and Gray vibes, but for like a quarter of the price, they are so freaking soft. <sighs> I just love them and they're fleece lined on the inside and it just feels like a warm hug when you put them on <sighs> but they're cuffed on the bottoms cuffed on the top there's an adjustable tie in my opinion it doesn't do too much like i wouldn't go up a few sizes and hope that this gets you down in the waist where you need to be i don't think it does too much but there is some adjustability and definitely size down i got these in an extra small and my normal size is a small and i could have gone down two sizes to an extra extra small i'll show you in the try on but like when i don't roll down the top of the pants at all they're just ginormous super baggy don't look the most flattering but if you give it two or three rolls they fit really nice and they're still baggy but they're that cute oversized look so definitely size down one size if you want a more fitted look size down two sizes but i just am obsessed with these i said i wasn't gonna wear them outside the house but like i wore them literally everywhere yesterday so i am wearing them outside the house and i love them i highly recommend these sweatpants my mom's already getting both of my sisters a pair for christmas yes we shop for christmas early around here this is my biggest recommendation from this video they're just so soft and comfy and I need to like get pants that aren't my boyfriend's sweatpants and these are like the perfect solution for that they feel as comfortable as just like boys baggy sweatpants but they're so much cuter the next item I'm going to talk to you guys about are these leggings these are also from the offline collection i got them in a small these are exactly what they say they are these are the real me leggings when i put these on i felt like i was naked like everybody's just exposed this is the real me take it or freaking leave it <laughs> that's how i felt in these so they're super comfortable and saying that they feel like you're wearing nothing but i am not to a place where i'm comfortable enough to go out in public walking around naked i'm not going to be keeping these especially just for gym wear especially in this color i wouldn't feel comfortable in the gym they show all lumps and bumps cellulite all that good stuff and there's just no compression it's just literally it's all, it's the real you baby it's all of you nothing wrong with that but i and myself am not confident enough for that so if you like compression these would not be the leggings for you but if you love just like buttery soft zero compression leggings these might be the leggings for you i'm actually tempted to buy them in black because i feel like that would be better at hiding lumps and bumps i do like them i would say it's more of a casual legging i'm definitely more into compression e-leggings for the gym but they have a cross waist it's still super high rise so it still goes above my belly button so i carry most of my fat in my stomach so i wish it was a little bit higher rise to cover up a little bit more of that that's my review of these leggings 
And then I also got the matching sports bra for these leggings. They're the same color. And I love this sports bra. I actually already wore it to the gym once and it's a long line sports bra. It has adjustable straps and bra cups, which was hard to come by in this haul. So I really appreciate that. I would say it's like medium across the board coverage as well as medium support. I jump rope at the gym. I'd say they supported me decently well and the size small fit perfectly, but I just love the sports bra. It's a super good basic. It has a little bit of cross detailing in the back and I really wanted to have a matching set with the sports bra and the leggings have a moment, but the leggings just didn't work for me. Okay, at least not in gym setting, but I recommend the bra. I think it's great. The next thing I'm gonna talk to you guys about is this considered a sports bra, but it's literally just <laughs> material. There is once again, no built-in cup pads, but there is a built-in shelf bra. And honestly, I mean, it's light support, very light support. I mean, I guess if it's cold, I would get nippage, but in a, just like an average temperature, it's not super noticeable, but there's no cup pads, if you know what I mean. And I would feel comfortable wearing this to the gym. I mean, I'm probably not gonna go run a marathon in it, there's no support for that, but just like walking around lifting weights. I think this totally works. It's long line, which I love. And I just love the silhouette of it. It's cross back, but there's adjustable straps and it's lower in the back. And I think it's super cute. I think I'm gonna keep it. I'm trying to decide if I wanna wear it to the gym or for casual wear. I'm leaning towards the gym since I kept that other long line black sports bra for casual wear. Just don't go into this expecting good support. It's definitely for your lower impact workouts. And it's just something super easy to throw on and go out. It's a very thin fabric. Just from feeling it, it feels like it would dry easily. It feels like very breathable and it's quite stretchy. This would definitely be for low impact or just like casual lounging. The next thing I want to show you guys is this top. It has like racing stripes on it. This is like a cute little crop top with racing stripes on it. Once again, there's no cup pads, but it does have a built-in shelf bra. So if I were gonna wear this, I would not wear a bra underneath it and I would feel comfortable. This could go either way. It could be for like a light support workout or it could just be for casual athleisure. I am not crazy about the shirt, to be honest with you. It's a lot shorter than I was expecting. I wish it was a little bit longer of a crop top. And also the back of the shirt is like too big. There's some gaping between my back in the back fabric and I thought it was gonna be more of a fitted shirt but it's fitted in the front and then just like a little bit flowy in the back and I don't know if that's intentional but I'm not crazy about this shirt I just can't see myself wearing it casually I'd much prefer just like a black plain shirt but it is cute once again it's that stretchy breathable fabric but it is slightly brushed on the outside so it's super soft like Aerie has really good materials this just it's not my vibe today but it is cute there it is yeah. And the last top I have to show you guys is this sports bra. Shockingly, another sports bra. It's just like a plain ass sports bra, honestly, as plain as it can get. It's ribbed, but it's just like the simple, you know, classic sports bra silhouette. Just that, and then the razor back in the back. And it's a ribbed tie-dye-ish material. So there's ribbing. Got in a small, just like everything else. And this just has way too little support for me. If I'm going to be wearing this as a sports bra, I'm going to expect at least a little bit of support. And this isn't the kind of shirt that you could wear a bra underneath it, in my opinion. So I would expect a little bit more support. I feel like the bottom band, it's not even tight. There's nothing to hold you in at all. There's no cup pads. The bottom band isn't even tight to give you support there. It's super stretchy which is good. Maybe if I size down, it would offer a little bit of compression, but I would just not feel comfortable walking around in this really. I feel like I would just like flop all over the place or something. So yeah, this isn't for me. Maybe you could wear it just like a casual athleisure top, possibly get a bra under there if you want to. Not my favorite. And I wasn't crazy about the colors in person either. So that was everything I picked up. That was actually relatively quick, quicker than I thought it was going to be. It was only like seven pieces. And overall, I am a fan of the Airy offline brand. I'm obsessed with Airy as it is, but their offline label, I really do appreciate. I feel like they give you really cute and trendy clothes, but they're affordable especially if you use the sales. Use the sales, don't buy full price. I wish that more things that I tried today had cup pads, but that's my bad for not double checking. I think everything I picked out today would suit well for like athleisure and a few pieces also are great in the gym. I would love to do another video like this. If you guys want me to, they have a bunch of stuff on the site. Let me know what you guys want to see in the comments below. If you like athleisure, active wear, 
hauls. I have a lot of videos like this on my channel that you can check out. There's gonna be a growing inventory of them on my channel. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to check me out on the Instagram. I need the Instagram, I'm such a boomer. I need to get better about posting on there, but I do have an Instagram if you guys wanna check it out. And uh, I'll see you guys next week. As always, thank you for the support and I will see you guys next Wednesday. Peace out, bye haters, peace.